want to go out in every game and try to try to establish the line of scrimmage because um, that's huge. You know, if you can run the ball, stop the run, that's that's the start to a great game for for a team. Um, offensively and defensively. So, you know, week in, week out, we want to do that, but we know, especially in our division, uh, you know, it's going to be a battle in there for sure. I know there have been a couple of games where you guys have maybe had to settle for field goals instead of punching it in the What was the difference today that allowed you to do that? Because you guys got ahead and got ahead. Yeah, I mean, I think you hit it. The defense put us in great positions to score down there. Um, and, you know, when, when Coach called run plays for us to be able to run in, punch it in, uh, you know, we executed. And I think that was huge um, for, you know, the next time. He's like, I'll, I'll call run plays again. Um, so we got to earn those from him um, and just, you know, keep performing in, in you know, short yarded situations as well. Because um, I think we had a couple of those where we were able to get first downs, which were huge to be able to just, they know we're running it, we know, and just try, try to get it. Do you have more confidence? Than last year, when those running plays are called, that will get punched in. That's something you know when you got to carry on and Lagoon. Can you repeat that? I didn't, I didn't catch the first part of that. Do you have more confidence this year that when the, those running plays are called, that you guys will punch it in? Because if we yeah, I mean it's just a different year. I think you know we're very confident in our, in our game plan going in. We're very confident that we can uh, execute uh, against good defensive fronts, and we got good backs that can get the yardage. Is there anything unique about blocking for a guy like Kerry on Johnson? Anything different about his style? Um, I mean, it's going to sound you know, silly, but at the end of the day, you know, my my job and my blocks are going to be the same. But to have a, a dynamic playmaker like that, they can make guys miss at the second level. Um, you know, he's a playmaker, and I think everybody's everybody's seen that. And you know, hopefully, he just keeps getting better and better. Seems this is a pure athlete. What do you think when you see Galladay making plays? He's unbelievable. Our, our receiving core is uh, obviously our quarterback and our receiving core are really top notch. So us as a line. You know, we know if we can give them time, we can make plays down the field and, uh, you know, big plays at that. Seems like with Garrett and Carrion are both kind of settling into their perspective roles. Um, yeah. Does that make it easier for you as an offensive line to kind of stay in a rhythm? Uh, just, just to be able to stay, you know, on schedule with the chains is huge. And, you know, they both play their particular roles, you know, given the down and distance or whatever packages we're going to run. Um, so just to be able to stay ahead of the chains, execute first down, second down, run situations, whatever it may be. Um, you know, it's huge. Just staying on schedule and not getting in second and longs, third and longs is huge.